Hello everyone and welcome back to another video brought to you by CockroachZone.com. As the title suggests, today we'll be briefly discussing whether or not roaches make noise. More specifically, noises that you can hear. Before we get started, let's take a quick look at this topic overview. Common household roaches don't make noise at night or during the day. On rare occasions, scurrying or flying can generate a soft sound. It will be nearly undetectable to humans. Wild species of cockroaches will vocalize through hissing and chirping. However, these noises are extremely soft, and roaches in your home cannot make them. So, as noted in our information, the common roaches that you find, and certainly hope not to find, in your home won't make much of a sound at all. If you think you hear a roach at night, chances are you are mistaking it for something else, quite possibly a different bug entirely. Let's take a closer look at this topic. While the common cockroach, what you'd find in your home, doesn't vocalize, it must be stated that there are well over 4,000 types of roach species, yet only four are common to your living space. What this really means is, in the big picture, is that nonverbal roaches are actually quite rare. Instead of noises, a house roach will communicate through pheromones. Roaches produce these through feces. This can impact the behavior of other roaches within the area. Because of this style of communication, Humans really won't hear a thing, as it relates to direct noise production, known as stridulations, because, yeah, well, they're just too faint to be detected by the human ear. While not all species of roaches can fly, the kind that are typically found in and around your home can fly. The American cockroach can not only fly, but it's quite fast, 3.4 miles per hour to be exact. In terms of what you might hear, yeah, still not too much unless one just comes buzzing right by your ear. The sound would certainly not be loud enough to hear from another room. In terms of scurrying, that won't make much of a sound either. But here's the kicker, and you probably know exactly what it is. You can't hear a roach scurrying, but you can hear the surface area, especially if it's something like a paper bag, potato chip bag, etc. The sound of what the roach is walking on can potentially give themselves away. If you're attempting to kill a roach, these sounds can be your friend on cueing you in to where to look. A single cockroach doesn't indicate much of anything, to be honest, other than perhaps a seasonal change. Cockroaches simply do not make enough noise. Even if you do have a problem, you're going to hear what they're walking on and manipulating, rather than hear any sound they would make from their body. If you're worried that you do have an infestation, please call a professional as soon as possible. Never wait on sounds, movements, etc. to serve as some form of tipping point cue. And on that note, that will conclude things for this video. However, if you'd like to know more concerning this topic, please be sure to visit us at CockroachZone.com. There you will find a full length and a highly detailed article that will cover everything that you would ever want to know about cockroach noises, including hissing and chirping and what it all really means. Are you currently watching us off-site? If so, please click the initial link in the description box below. Said link will take you to this valuable information. And until our paths cross again, and I certainly hope they do, we'd like to thank you once again for joining us today. Please have a wonderful day. All the best to you and yours, and we will talk to you later.